Agents at the U.S. border with Mexico have begun moving thousands of Haitian migrants sheltering under a bridge in the Texas town of Del Rio. The increasingly poor conditions under the Del Rio International Bridge, which connects the Texas city with Mexico, led the Department of Homeland Security to accelerate flights to Haiti and other destinations within the next 72 hours. The DHS over the weekend said some 2,000 people were removed to other immigration processing stations on Friday as the town has been overwhelmed by an influx of Haitian and other migrant groups. The department said the transfers will continue to ensure that migrants are, quote, swiftly taken into custody, processed and removed from the United States, consistent with our laws and policy. But many, like Haitian migrant Alex Rosier, fear returning to their homeland. If I am deported now, I'll die in Haiti. Why? Because there's no security in Haiti. There are bandits. There is civil war every day. It's very complicated because there is no leadership in Haiti. There is nothing. While migrants seeking jobs and safety have been making their way to the U.S. for months, it is only in recent days that the number converging on Del Rio has drawn widespread attention, posing a humanitarian and political challenge for the Biden administration.